everyone and welcome to this Jmeter tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn how to fix the problem you faced in the latest Jmeter in order to save your script. So let's begin. In the latest version of the Jmeter, when you create some script and try to save that script, you will not be able to save that. Okay, so let's see what is the error and then we will see how we can fix that error. For example, I am right now using Apache Jmeter 5.4.3. I am just creating some sample script here just to show you what happens. So I have added some thread group and one request. Now I will try to save this. Okay. Let me click on this save button and you see nothing happened. Okay. Now again, if I click on the file, click on save, nothing happens. Similarly, if I go here, click on save test plan as no pop up appears. Okay. So this is a problem. Now, exactly, we don't know what is the problem. In order to know that, what is the problem and what exception we are getting, what you need to do is that just click on the save button once and you will see here, you will see one error here. Click on this one and this will appear here. And you can see we are getting an error. Okay. So this file dollar is not being initiated because this class does not found. Okay. Now this is an error. If you go on internet and search for the solution, so people suggested is that you need to change the look and feel. For that, you need to go to look and feel and you need to change into the windows. You need to restart this one. Okay. And once it will get restarted, now you will see that you will get this option now. Okay. So again, adding a thread group here, adding a sample request here. Now, when I click on this one, you see the pop up appears here in order to save your script. But this solution will not work when you have to use a particular theme. For example, if I want to use this dark theme, okay, so I will not be able to use this feature. Okay. So I have restarted this one. Let me open the JMeter here. And again, let me add a thread group, adding a sample request. And again, you see, it will not work. Right. So this means this solution will not work if you have to use a theme. Now, what is the solution? Okay. So solution is very simple here. What you need to do is that you need to go to the bin directory and you need to open this windows jmeter.bat file in any editor. So I'm using notepad plus plus. So you can use any other and you need to traverse to this line 112. Okay. This is how it looks like. Okay. Set Java 9 underscore ops. And this is, these are the lines available there. So you need to traverse at the end of this line and you need to add this line here. Okay. So you need to copy this one and you need to add this line here. You need to save this one, close this one, close the JMeter and now run the JMeter again. Okay. JMeter is up and running. Let me add thread group. Now, let me add sampler here. Okay. And if I now click on this one, it will show the pop up to save the request. Similarly, if I change the look and feel to any other, for example, I personally like this solarized dark. Let me click on this one. Yes, restart this one. And after restarting, if I open this one, and again, let me add a thread group then request. Okay. And now if I click on the save, you will see that we can now have this save option. If you go here on the file section, you can also click on this one and it will work. Similarly, if you go here, save test plan as so it will work as well. Thank you so much for watching this tutorial. If you like our content, then do like, comment, share and subscribe our channel. Once again, thank you so much for watching this tutorial. Hope this helps you out. See you in the next lecture.